hi my beautiful gemini welcome to my channel goddess of light 1111 if you are new to my channel welcome if you are returning subscribers welcome back this reading is for my lovely beautiful gemini sun moon rising venus and jupiter thank you god thank you universe universal energies ancestors spirit guide archangels ascended masters please give my lovely beautiful gemini a clear precise honest message for the highest good all right gemini if you are new to my channel don't forget to hit the subscribe the like button and the notification bell below and if you are returning subscribers welcome back so i do appreciate each and every one of you guys that have been supporting my channel i'm sending lots of love blessing and prosperity your way all right gem let's see what the universe has for you let's see what spirit got to say for you co-creating so for some of you right off the bat you're getting some type of justice you could be dealing with an emperor or someone that is come as an emperor someone that is very wise but i felt like you definitely you definitely get, get some type of stability there could be someone that's come as an emperor so you could be dealing with an uh, aries but I feel like whomever you are dealing with and stuff like that, they come as very, you know, someone that is very much in the power, very structured, a lot of stability here. Show me the energy. Message for <laughs> message for Gemini spirit. Gemini, so let's go. Show me the uh, energy. Gemini. So the fate. So I feel like this star is a line for you guys to be in this relationship. So you guys could be getting paying some karma debt. I feel like that's what I'm feeling here. This so this is the fate here. This is about a fated event, something that meant to happen for you guys. We have number 17 that's turning two and eight. So this whatever this happening and stuff like that, I feel like it's going to bring you guys prosperity. So this is meant to happen. Message for Gemini spirit. So we have community. This I feel like whomever you are dealing with and stuff like that, there is this it could be you guys could be meeting a lot of people. I feel like spirit your spirit, your angel, your spirit guy, you know, your ancestors. You are being guided and stuff like that into a community. You are being guided. This is like, like I said, this is you guys getting some type of rewards here. So whatever, whomever you are trying to build here, there's a lot of people that's going to come to your aid. See, there's number eight again. So like I say, I feel like prosperity, wealth and abundance, and it doesn't have to be money when I say that. So just keep that in open mind. So you guys could be want to have to have family around. You guys could want to have some type of family. There's a lot of people around you. You guys could be, you know, abundance could be that you are gloriously happy. So I feel like whatever this is for you guys and stuff, it's very much abundance with this community here. Message for Gemini. So the yang energy, that's beautiful. So you guys could be in your masculine energy, male or female, because you guys have a lot of creativity. The wall is your oyster. You know, the universe is telling you here again, there's the star. The star is aligning for you guys on perfect alignment of the star. For you guys, you know, to have some type of creativity, to have a new beginning. I feel like whatever this new beginning here and stuff like that, the world is in your hand to for the taking. To whatever you want to make of it and stuff like that, it's beautiful here. Beautiful. Because you guys are in your masculine energy. So we have to be fair. So there's a situation that's coming towards you guys. I feel like the universe is bringing you again. There's the owl. I feel like you are your spirit guy, your angel, your ancestors. They are bringing balance into your life. They are bringing you some type of justice, uh, Gemini. So you're getting some type of justice. That's lovely. This is your justice. This, this is perfect alignment for you guys to get this justice with whomever you are dealing with. <laughs> so we have, we have getting to know each other. 
as you reveal your animal self so this is could be someone you are trying to get to know and we have codependency it could be a capricorn you guys are dealing with um but i feel like forgiving and learning so there is someone in your past you need to forgive you need to release you need to let go of that's what i'm feeling here because you know um people do holding grudges and stuff like that but masculine they normally and stuff like that you know if you find a masculine that hold a grudge they hold a grudge but most of the time and stuff like that is feminine energy and stuff you know if they're not aligned that holding gorgeous and stuff very soon clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now so i feel like definitely this person whomever that's coming towards you guys someone might want your forgiveness they might there's someone that wants that want your forgiveness um gemini someone from your past yeah you're dealing with a soulmate so it could be a karmic soulmate and stuff. Just keep that uh, just keep that in mind. But I feel like, you know, yeah, spirit say stay optimistic. Like I say, keep that in mind. So I feel like whomever that soulmate you are dealing with and stuff, you know, there could be some type of addiction, whomever this person here. But the code codependency mean doesn't mean that you guys are codependent. It could be like you guys cohabited with each other also. Show me the energy of the person Gemini is dealing with spirit. <laughs> so we have the emperor i'm telling you i was feeling this energy here you're dealing with someone that is very structured very stable very grounded and stuff that wants stability that want marriage they want some type of structures and stability and stuff someone that is could be a boss or leader and their main focus is you so six of cups so definitely there's someone from your past there's always someone from your past that wants to be with you. It could be a Leo. You guys are dealing with Gemini. But I feel like six of wands here. So that's definitely what I'm feeling here. So there could be a Leo that is want to give you a lot of attention. Someone from your past here with the six of cups. Six of wands. We have two six here with this emperor. This is this person. They're standing in their power. Whatever they say, go. This person might be, you know, this might be someone that is a little bit controlling of their own wise, very self-empowered, very, you know, self-assured. But I feel like whomever this is you are dealing with, they want to give you, there's someone from your past that want to give you some type of attention. It could be a Leo. Okay. What is this person want Gemini to know, spirit? we have the queen of wands so they see you as a boss or leader they also see you as very sexy very attractive they are coming towards you guys with the three of wands so you guys could be you know this is someone that you know working and letting go of the past so they can come towards you and we have the nine of cups so they're coming with some type of apology for you leo they want to apologize to you because this person want to give you some type of attention they want to be with you so they they want to apologize to you because they see how sexy you are they see how attractive you are you standing in your power and stuff like that you make things happen and this person also very structured so it's kind of hard for you i felt like it'll be kind of hard for you to deal with this person because this is someone that's like i call this shot i make this shot i say what goes whatever goes that's what happened what does this person want to say to Gemini? Yeah, Ten of Wands. So, because you guys are, might not be... So, if you guys, you know, even if you guys are together, this person might feel like the situation is a burden with the Ten of Wands. There's some type of ending to a burden. And stuff, the way of sorts, this person is strategizing how to come towards you without feeling this burden because this person is praying for you. They're praying for reconciliation. They're praying, someone in here is praying to have a reconciliation with you. Wow. Okay. King of Wands here. So there could be, you know, a fire sign that wants to be with you could be a Leo to be specific. But I feel like whomever this is, someone in here, again, they are praying to be with you. They are praying to reconcile with you. 
because they wants to be with you let's clarify the six of cups that's the person energy clarify the six of cups they want to offer you love but they see you guarded and defensive this is someone that is very persistent to see how they see you. This is someone that finds you very, very attractive. This person might be a little bit addicted to you. I feel like, you know, this one, this person might be a little bit addicted to you, but they see you very guarded, very defensive. They might also see you as spiritually protected. It's kind of hard for them to get through you, but what they want to give you and receive, giving and receiving love, they want reciprocity and giving and receiving love with you. It is someone from your past so that's what they want clarify the emperor yeah i told you they want a reconciliation with you and they want they want an honest communication with you they're going to send you some type of message they want to speak the truth to you they want to tell you the truth the fact that they want uh happy happy reconciliation with you they want to celebrate something to you this person might message you the fact that they're missing you a little bit that's what i'm feeling here let's clarify the seven of swords they are praying for reconciliation with you mm -hmm. ace of wands nine of swords and six of cups yep someone is very someone from your past is very persistent to be with you they want to communicate with you this person might be a little bit angry a little bit upset they might be disappointment a little bit but they want they're coming towards you whomever this person from your past gemini they're coming towards you guys they are planning to come towards you guys to offer you a passionate new beginning and they are going to make it happen they're going to apol even apologize first, but they are planning. Clefa the Queen of Wands. Yeah, they see you as very stable, very grounded, and they see you single. Two of Swords. They are trying. They see you have a decision. You are. You have to make a decision here. Someone have a decision to make whether they're gonna choose you or a family. That's what I'm feeling here. Someone could have a family they are dealing with, but they are trying to choose. They have a decision to make because you single and stuff like that. You single, you feel your abundance and stuff, beautiful, sexy, smelling good, all that good stuff. But they have a decision to make between you and someone else. Someone they call family, someone they might have children with. Clarify the Ten of Wands. <clears throat> Here you are, the magician, the hierophant, and the knight of cups. Yeah, they want to apologize. They want to apologize to you, then commit. Once this person communicate with you, I feel like the magician is it. They want to communicate with you. Once they communicate with you, apologize. They are going to ask you for um, some type of commitment here. That's what I'm feeling here. So be prepared. Prepare yourself to receive this commitment, Gemini. Because they are nine of cups here. They're going to apologize. They're going to communicate, apologize, apologize to you, and then offer you a commitment. Like I said, this is someone that is pray, praying. This person is praying to have a reconciliation with you. They want to tell you the truth here, but they have to make a decision between you and somebody else. Clarify the night. Um, let's clarify the three of wands. Clarify the three of wands. Yeah, they are going to communicate. Again, this is about communication. I feel like this person is walking away to find wish fulfillment so they can be happy. But I feel like you you guys have been guided. Gemini, I feel like this person felt like they've been guided. They need they are spiritually guided here with the angel of temperance to find balance to find peace and harmony to find healings this is someone that's been guided to you and they're gonna start making things move quickly between you guys there's a, a, a um, forward movement fast movement something that's going to start happening very quickly between you guys let's clarify the faith 
have had the fate here. Yeah, five of pentacles, seven of cups. <laughs> Why? Well, I told you this person is praying. They're not going to get the chance. This is someone that is praying to be with you. They are in their head. They're having sleepless night, anxiety, anxiousness because they want to be with you here. They feel left out on the call. They're feeling left abandoned. They're feeling the abandonment. This person is really, really, really want to be with you. So are they, they are praying. They are praying it's not too late and stuff like that. That, you know, even if there is, you have other option here, they don't care. I feel like someone in here worried, they stress out. You have other people, you have other option. They might not have a chance to be with you. So they are praying for a second chance with you. They are praying for a reconciliation with you. But between you, between me and you, they might be too late. Clarify the uh, six of wands. Let's clarify the six of wands. Four of wands. And the nine of cups. Their wish, this person wish is to marry you. Wow. Gemini, this is plot twist. This person wish is to marry you. Their wish is to have stability with you. Their wish is to become one with you you might be dealing with the twin flame like i said so this person wish is to marry you this person wishes to be with you they worry there's other people they worry there's you have other option and they stress out that they might not get a chance to be with you mm. so see there's ace of cups they want to offer you all type of love all type of love this person want to offer you the judgment here so i saw the ace of pentacles the judgment here spirit is say that this person will have to make a judgment call they will have to announce they're in love with you they will have to announce it they they wants to be with you they are they have to make an announcement they they love you they wants to be with you in order for this relationship to connection to work they have to make it as an announcement they have to tell you they have to say it wow if they wants to be with you i'm realize your love was holding me together Mm hmm sometime i wonder if i'm saying so is enough <laughs> please don't hate me for ghosting you you didn't deserve it so gemini if this person ghosting you that's their loss that's why they scramble to be with you now that's why they are struggling to be with you if that's if that's like i say it's their loss are you in love with me or my potential is at the bottom but that's going to be their loss because they're going to have to like spirit say they're going to have to announce they're going to have to literally scream they're going to have to telling you that they cannot just like want a reconciliation with you and expect it they're going to have to tell you they love you and that's their judgment their judgment if they want to have that reconciliation they're praying for they have to tell you they love you they have to announce they love you they have to let others know they love you oh i'm a lovely gemini that's all i have for you guys don't forget to like subscribe and share the video by Gemini, but their wishes to marry you, to have stability with you.